Ready? Hey, how you doing? We're down here at Catalina. We're going to talk to you about ground fish. Look at that. Pure source of protein, no additives, nothing added. We grind it up all the time. Utilization of the whole fish, broken fillets, those fillets that aren't just restaurant perfect. Uh, they go into the grinder that we have. And the great thing about this stuff is, look at this. This texture, you know what, I'm just going to start. The texture with these is unbelievable because, okay, think of that meatball right there with, no, it's not my mom, so I'm not answering. So you can make a meatball, pasta and clamps with a fish meatball, add your garlic salt, add some onion, add all of that neat stuff to it, and you'll be able to create an unbelievable dish. But what's even better is your kid's a picky eater. We're gonna make a burger out of this. Okay, and again, I want you to look at this and see that this is all fish, okay? There's nothing added into it. There's no binding agents or anything. It's just fish. We're gonna place that on there just like that. Okay, a little bit more. Okay, just like that. Now, we're going to put a little bit of lemon on here just to play with it. Okay, we're going to go standard. Just some pepper. Some salt. And we're going to cook it off. Now, when we make the when we make this ground fish, we kind of utilize what we're cutting at that time. So Corvina sea bass, like this, it's all Corvina sea bass. The yellowtail, the yellowtail burgers go great. Just imagine making yellowtail hamburger with a grilled pineapple and a teriyaki glaze on it, and like a Hawaiian sweet bread roll. It's super cool, and it's great protein and it's healthy for your kids instead of those yucky, frozen, steamed, drive-through burgers. Look at this, look, it's browning, it's beautiful, it's got great flavor. Okay, so it's really neat. I'm gonna touch it off with just a little bit more oil on there. Again. Ground up fish, you can see just by looking that there's nothing in here except for the fish. It's all pure meat, 100%. No filler, no additives, no binders, certainly no chemicals. It's not farmed fish, it's a wild product. Corvina sea bass coming out of Baja. We've got it down here this weekend or most weekends. And what else? Let's put something else on it. I got a little granulated onion. Okay, just got to put a little bit on there. And then, you know, if you really don't want that whole steam or the whole uh, bright effect, what you do, here's something I'll show you that's kind of a cool trick. Where's that? There it is. Right here. Watch this. So you want to get that effect of steam, and then you cover it up like that, and you let it get in there, and it kind of steams the juices and everything like that. So that's what you got, ground Corvina. Ground up fish, utilization of the whole thing. Um, you can do little cocktail balls, okay? Fry them up in some grapeseed oil, put a toothpick in them, use them for dipping. You can use it just like you would ground beef. Substitute ground beef with all that yucky stuff in it for this right here. Brown it up, serve it in lasagna. Make a marinara sauce with meat sauce. Instead of the meat, use the ground fish. You can do the original fish stick. If you took this and you made a ball out of it, okay, and you just rolled it out a little bit and you made something like this, nice and long, 
and you run a stick through it and you can barbecue that, that would be like the original fish stick. So step outside the box. Remember, you are what you eat. Think about what you're eating because not all fish are the same. We're going to do a quick check. Oh yeah, that's hot. Look at this. That's beautiful. We're going to cut this open. Right there. Look at that. That's a beautiful, white, flaky piece of fish right in there. Beautiful. That's what we got down here at Catalina. Ground fish. Ask for it. Look for it on the internet. Good things are happening. Let them happen for you. See you later. We're out.